welcome to the Amsterdam vlog. here in Amsterdam for the weekend it's now Friday we arrived yesterday late last night yeah it was late so we just went to bed we've had breakfast this morning the buffet and now we're out to explore see the surroundings yes got recommended a street waffle place but we Strangely enough. yeah but we walked past uh, this so i assume it, it looks nice and i think i've seen it somewhere online so <laughs> yeah, yeah we, we weren't going to go for any of these that's too much for us so, so we're just we... gonna ha go for a plain one yeah judge it by its uh, merits yeah but i love a starbucks troop waffle yeah honest, so. so this has to be good mm. the weather could be better Oh, it's warm. It is warm. I think most of the caramel's in uh, in the middle, so I didn't mm -hmm. get much caramel on first Me bite. Me neither. Mm. There we go. It's better? That's better. I didn't know it was supposed to have cinnamon in it. I think that's the thing. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I, don't think the, I don't think the Starbucks one has. I, I can't remember, but um, this kind of it has a slight taste of um, gingerbread. Yeah. It's really good, though. Mmm. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's good. Oh, yeah, you can actually. So, we're on to lunch part two. So, we're going for some fries and. Uh, I thought this was funny because Klein in Norwegian means awkward. <laughs> <laughs> I have one awkward fries. I mean, this might not be like the fine schmecker place for locals, more like a tourist thing. But I mean, it's fries. We yeah. need to have fries. Yeah. So we went for uh, ketchup and mayo. Yeah. You that is a big dollop of mayo. <laughs> it is. You don't... I thought maybe you would get it on the side. <laughs> I thought so too. You don't, you don't really get much time to decide what kind of sauce no. you want. It's like, ah, oh, ketchup mayo. <laughs> yeah. It's like that, like 30 sauces. So it's like, how do you decide yeah. Did when you, you get that like- Did you see that they have apple sauce? I, yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> and half of them I didn't understand what no, were. Yeah. <laughs> so that is the place we were at. And look at this cute little street. To be fair, all streets are like this here. They're just I mean, adorable. Amsterdam is probably one of the most like beautiful architectural cities. Yeah. It's beautiful. Here. Yeah.
we're back at the hotel. We actually have been for a while. I think it's uh, about two hours. We never showed you the hotel, but it, it's a mess now. <laughs> oh yeah, I did uh, do some clips when we arrived. So um, I'll maybe overlay those because that that's more accurate for how it looks. Now it's just like messy. <laughs> no, that's a shame. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we've been home for a couple hours. Home, home at the hotel. Uh, my uh, Achilles is uh, hurting quite a bit. So Matt got me like some um, painkiller gel to put on it. Hopefully that will work. Hopefully that works. I also wanted to show you something we got from the breakfast buffet that we were very excited to test out. We have never seen, I've never seen this before. I'm just gonna put you here. They have like this sprinkle um, toast topper. Like sprinkles in dark chocolate, uh, milk chocolate and in fruity. That is so exciting. I guess that you think they melt or do you think they're supposed to I be? I was thinking about her earlier. I think maybe they melt. It's raining quite a bit outside, if you can hear. Yeah, it's weird. I'm actually... very, very excited for this. So we didn't test it at the uh, breakfast buffet, but I want to bring them home to test them at home. The breakfast buffet has, was very good. Like the toast was good. All the top, like all the like eggs, bacon, everything was delicious. And the mm -hmm. coffee was also coffee in Amsterdam good. has been really good yeah yeah we were at we showed you we were at a cafe the coffee there was amazing like yeah. amazing that was so good and we also love the fries just that I don't really like them to top the fries I know that's the thing here but I like the dipping to be on the side yeah because some of the fries were like swimming in mayo and not edible in my opinion no and then, like I was saying if they were swimming in ketchup I would enjoy it. Yeah. But like swimming in mayo is a bit different. Uh, yeah. But the fries themselves were delicious. Like amazing. Oh yeah, I wanted to show you one more thing. I got a couple of these from the uh, airport on our way here because I wanted just something easy and protein rich to have here. And this was so good. In the toffee flavor. We got it in tiramisu as well. I, I don't think I would buy that again, but this I highly recommend. So I think that's all the updates. Um, I did have a bath to see if that would <laughs> help uh, the Achilles. And now we're going out uh, for dinner at um, a place called the Blue Dutchman or uh, the uh, uh, Blower Hollander. Yeah, <laughs> if it's if they have a uh, seating for us, if there's Hopefully. available tables. I mean, it's in a, it's in an area just south of the city center so it should have a lot of food places I'm sorry yeah it should have a lot of food places yeah there, so hopefully well, we want some dutch food it looks that's why it looks delicious online yeah hopefully yeah we'll be able to do that or we will just find something else yeah but yeah we're we're catching an uber because of my foot and because of the rain yeah like i don't you can't know really if you... see it. that's the update um yeah let's eat let's eat I think we will be getting the, these ones for starters because I think these are very Dutch and we will both be having the stump pot with the tender beef and carrot. That looks delicious. I, th I feel like this is really hot inside, probably. Probably. Oh yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try it without the mustard. Okay. <laughs> you can see the steam. That is good. Yum. Mm. That is looking so good. It is. I'm hardly touching it. That reminds me of Edinburgh, the yeah. food we had there. Yeah. It does. You wanna grab a bite? Okay, this looks hot. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> everything is like straight out of the kitchen, like piping hot. Mm. That's really good. <laughs> That's really good. I need this. One of our favorite things to do check out the grocery stores oh yeah and we have 
as a couple of sodas. We found the Biscoff Crunchy here. We ha don't have that, so had to have that. Had to. And just looking to see if we can find some desserts. We didn't know that this would be that big, so maybe we should have gone for one to share. But uh, so this is uh, a very popular place that we got recommended, and we wanted to try their apple pie. We like going all Dutch today. I mean, it's good to try anything local. Yeah, this has massive apple pieces. It's basically just apples. It's good though. It's very noisy here. Yeah. I mean, it's very windy. I was gonna say. It's better than I thought. I'm not typically an apple cake person or apple pie person, but this was really good. So we're at Flower Market and look at these cute little flower pots. That is so cute! <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want one. Yeah, I kind of want one too. These are probably the, the prettiest cactus... cactuses? Cactus? Cacti. Cacti? I, I think it's actually cacti. Oh my god. <laughs> I would never guess. Aren't they pretty? I don't think that would go well in the suitcase though. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck trying. <laughs> So we've just had a uh, coffee here at uh, Screaming Beans, which I think is uh, one of the places we saw recommended. Mm -hmm. And uh, across the street here is a cookie shop that we also have gotten recommended. So we're going to have one cookie like as a sample. We need from to. There. Yeah, it looks good. Okay, so we uh, to get uh, a little bit of everything. They have very simple flavors, but we wanted all the chocolate, so we got triple chocolate, with that, which has dark milk and white. Yeah. Okay. Mm. That's really good. Yeah. Lots of chips. Oh yeah, that's a very simple cookie. It but is. I, I love um, all the chocolates. Yeah. That kind of makes it perfect. It's crispy on the outside and nice and like. Not chewy, mm -hmm. but like soft on the inside. It feels like a clean cookie. It does. Compared to the cream one from London. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's Anne Frank's house. That thing. <laughs> <laughs> kind of sad they built it in. Yeah. It doesn't look like the original house, I, think, I no, imagine. No, it looks like a um, communal... Looks like a public uh, building. Yeah, like offices or something. Yeah. <laughs> so that's where we were yesterday and had the apple pie so fortunately we did it yesterday because that is the line to get in <laughs> and next to it it looks like there's a market today So we're at this place called uh, Bakers and Roasters and we were so lucky because they're all completely full but they had one table outside that no one wanted. And we were like... We were like, yes! yes. <laughs> and we already know what we want because we checked them on Google and we want this one. Eggs, toast and pancakes. It's like everything 
a little bit of everything. And we're going for a cup of tea, I think. That is probably the breakfast of dreams for me. <laughs> this is the perfect breakfast. <laughs> that is one creamy egg. That's so creamy. Very good. Okay, I want to try this one as well. And it looks like blueberry pancakes. Oh yeah. Mm. They taste like marshmallow. Oh wow. Maybe because of the powdered sugar, but it tastes like marshmallow. Hmm. Yum. Oh, thank you. Well, yeah. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. Maybe a tiny. <laughs> thank you. So we needed to have one more stroopafel before we can say that we've tested it. Yeah, huh? And uh, I think this place is much more authentic. I think so. And I think it's one of the most popular ones, if I'm not mistaken. Rudy's Original. It's a family recipe, they say, and the guys there are so nice. Yeah, super nice. This is like a minute off mm. the press. Mm -hmm. mm. Much better than the other one. Yeah, they know what they're doing. They do. <laughs> final day the clock is now five past nine and we are we have been packing and we're going out now to do the canal cruise yesterday we went out and had dinner at a place that just Matt found on Google that had good reviews and it's like a steak place it was a delicious steak yeah. and uh, the guy I think he was probably the owner. It was so nice. Yeah, it was real nice. Yeah, the steak was like so tender, and we had mushroom sauce, and uh, I had potatoes, and Matt had fries. So yeah, that was a good, very very good experience. We we're going to uh, go out and look for dessert, and uh, yeah, we ended up on Dunkin' Donuts because a lot of the cafes and stuff it closed pretty early, and we saw that Dunkin' had a lot of like Netherland donuts, but also Halloween donuts. But we only went for one because we didn't, didn't want to have more, but we went for the Stroopwafel. And it, that was a combination because it, it was kind of like Halloween looking-ish. The Halloween themed donuts were really tempting. I think those would have been better because the Stroopwafel donut didn't taste like Stroopwafel waffle at all, except for the actual Stroopwafel on top. But the donut itself is delicious. If you, uh, if you don't know, we don't have Dunkin' or any of those chains in Norway. And I just also wanted to mention like uh, both of these days we have like been exploring and walking a lot around a lot but we haven't like filmed everything because one we're, this is our vacation and two you can't really capture the city's beauty on camera no. it's actually impossible so uh, yeah we have been walking like I think yesterday was 25,000 steps yeah around there yeah so we've been walking a lot and exploring all the neighborhoods. Yesterday we were at the flower market, we were at 9th Street and Jordan. 
you were done. It was a really, really nice and long walk. And uh, we wanted to go to the Van Gogh Museum, but they were like booked for like three weeks straight. So we'll probably do that next time. And yeah, we have both been to Amsterdam before. So we have done stuff here before also. But now we're going on a canal cruise because that I have never done before and you have never nope. done before. Yeah, so that that's what we're doing. And our plane leaves at six. So we have a couple hours before that. So let's go to the canal. Take a look to the left into the canal in a second. We're gonna see a beautiful view of the southern church. So we're here to yeah. pick our own to make our own Tony's bar. Okay. Okay, so I go for milk. Pretzel, caramel, and sea salt. Okay. <laughs> Yay, pay! So we both made our own chocolate and it's supposed to be done at 10 past 1. So it's like an hour or something, I think. Yep. I so. chose um, pretzel and biscoff on a milk chocolate base. Now we're going in if to find something to eat. And we have walked past a place that serves egg. Like it's called omelette a couple of times. I think maybe if they have a table, we will go there. Okay, so the egg place where they had a crazy line. So, crazy. Yeah, so we had to walk far to find another place. So we went to sandwich shop Amsterdam and I got a tuna melt and Matt got a kind of a pastrami melt. There you go, enjoy the chocolate. Thank you. So we just got our chocolate. Both Ooh. went for a nice purple. I like your color combination. Thank you, I like yours. <laughs> and you get the like uh, flavoring here and I guess your name is there. Let's see, can we sneak peek? It says, don't give to buddy. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're heading to the train station. That's over there. And off to the airport we go. Okay, so that is it for this vlog. We had such a fun weekend and we both can't wait to come back here. I think we want to take another trip in spring. So I guess we will do everything we didn't have time to then. But if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.